हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू कटिंग एंड स्टिचिंग ऑफ डिजाइनर प्रिंसेस कट फ्रॉक द मेजरमेंट इज लाइक दिस टोटल लेंथ ऑफ द फ्रॉक इज 38 इंच बुडाइस लेंथ 16 इंच शोल्डर टू शोल्डर विथ 14 इंच शोल्डर लेंथ 8 इंच चेस्ट 36 इंच वेस्ट लेंथ 16 इंच वेस्ट 30 इंच बॉटम स्कर्ट लेंथ 22 इंच बॉटम विथ 53 इंच स्लीव लेंथ 21 एंड हाफ इंच स्लीव विथ 4.5 इंच कफ लेंथ 2 एंड हाफ इंच हाफ कफ विथ 4 एंड हाफ इंच फ्रंट नेक लेंथ 5.25 इंच बैक नेक लेंथ इस नेल बिकॉज वी विल इंसर्ट जिप एट बैक पीस नेक विथ 7.5 इंच बैक साइड कफ कट लेंथ 3 इंच दिस इज माई फैब्रिक एंड फॉर दिस मेजरमेंट वी रिक्वायर नियर अबाउट थ्री मीटर ऑफ फैब्रिक एंड द नेक पोर्शन वी विल मेक फ्रॉम ब्लैक फैब्रिक फर्स्ट फोल्ड फैब्रिक विद वाइज एंड कट बोडाइज लेंथ प्लस वन टू वन पॉइंट फाइव इंच स्ट्रेट बोडाइज लेंथ इज सिक्सटीन इंच प्लस वन इंच इज इक्वल टू सेवनटीन इंच मार्क एट सेवनटीन पॉइंट फाइव इंच एंड कट इट नाउ फोल्ड दिस बोडाइज फैब्रिक इन फोर लेयर which is equal to 1 by 4 of chest plus 2 inch that is 36 divided by 4 plus 2 makes it 11 inch and then do bodice drafting and cutting on it at top mark half of shoulder to shoulder width plus half inch width wise that is 14 divided by 2 plus half inch makes it 7.5 inch from this point mark shoulder length lengthwise that is 8 inch and cross mark it with 7.5 inch and take half inch less then join these two points to upper mark From the same shoulder length, mark 1 by 4 of chest plus 2 inch widthwise. That is 36 divided by 4 is equal to 9 plus 2 inch is equal to 11 inch. Mark at 9 and 11 inch. At bottom, this is our waist length 2. Take 1 by 4 of waist plus 2 inch. That is 30 divided by 4 is equal to 7.5 inch plus 2 inch. Is equal to 9.5 inch. Mark at 7.5 and 9.5 inch mark. Now join this waist point to chest mark in slant manner. We make our neck on fusion paper, so we take only neck width and then make a slant line till shoulder length line and do arm curving. Neck width is 7.5 inch. Its half is 3.75 inch. Mark it and make a half inch slant line till shoulder length line. And now do curving for front and back sleeves. We are making it princess cut. so we measure length and width of plates and after that we do cutting of it plate length is 11.5 inch so take 12 inch half inch for swing seam at shoulders and width is 3.25 inch mark it and cross mark it at bottom and now join both points in straight manner and from front arm curve 
we take in round manner like this. This is our princess cut pattern and cutting is done like this. Separate back portion and cut front sleeve curve and princess cut pattern also. This is our front bodice cutting and now we do same cutting at back piece also. Fold back piece and front piece on it and cut alongside princess cut pattern. This is our bodice cutting and this is our front bodice and this is our back bodice piece. After that fold remaining fabric lengthwise and from open side take bottom skirt length plus 3 inch that is 22 plus 3 makes it 25 inch. Mark it and cut it. Now fold widthwise bottom skirt fabric in 4 layers and at top take 1 by 4 of waist that is 30 divided by 4 is equal to 7.5 inch plus 2 inch for swing seam mark it at 9.5 inch and add 4 inch more for inserting of plates that is 9.5 inch plus 4 inch makes it 13.5 inch Bottom skirt width is 53 inch, add 1 inch, mark it at 54 inch and then take half of it that is 27 inch. Now measure bottom skirt length lengthwise that is 27.5 inch and from 13.5 inch mark measure 27.5 inch in slant manner like this. And at bottom do a bit curving for better finishing. Cut this curve and join 13.5 inch to 27.5 inch mark in slant manner. and then cut it. This is our bottom skirt cutting. After that from remaining cloth we do drafting and cutting of sleeves. After folding fabric widthwise Mark sleeve length plus 1 inch that is 21.5 plus 1 is equal to 22.5 inch and then cut it. Now fold it again widthwise that is in 4 layers equal to shoulder length plus 1 inch that is 8 plus 1 makes it 9 inch. We are making puff sleeves so take cross cut 7.25 inch and on opposite side take near about 3 inch widthwise and join these two points like this. And now do front sleeve curving. At bottom take sleeve width 
plus 1 inch that is 4.5 inch plus 1 makes it 5.5 inch and join these points to 7.25 inch mark. Cutting is done like this. Open it in two layers and do front arm sleeve cutting. In stitching, we sew princess cut matching right to right like this starting from armhole till bottom. Like this we sew other side of princess cut too. Make sure that your side fabric must come on top while stitching and from other side start from bottom till armhole. After that do press stitching on right side taking extra fabric on the side parts. After press stitching, now come to neck portion and fold fusion paper equal to half of neck width plus 1 inch. That is 7.5 divided by 2 is equal to 3.75. Mark it widthwise and take 1 to 1.25 inch extra and mark it. In length, take front neck length plus half inch that is 5.25 plus half. In length, take front neck length plus half inch that is 5.25 plus 0.5 is equal to 5.75 inch. Make a box and after that do neck drafting. Our designer front neck cut length is 2.5 inch. Mark it from neck bottom and take its width half of the length that is 1.25 inch and mark it. And make a V shape front neck cut. Now, do front neck curving. Then make seam pattern, minding a gap of 1 to 1.25 inch and then cut inner and outer pattern lines and curves. I will darken it with dark pencil and then I will show you how to cut it. This is our neck design cutting and now paste it on extra fabric and sew it on front bodice matching right to right. Pin up it and mark small cuts then fold the wrong side that I already taught you. Link is given in description. After that I will proceed further. After making neck now take centers of bodice and bottom skirt. Now place bottom skirt and bodice matching right to right and first pin it up at center. After that I will show you how to insert plates. Now pin up side part of the bottom skirt and bodice
and extend it till princess cut stitching. Now gather all extra fabric on princess cut stitching and take it to the center region and pin up it too. It is our near about 2 inch plate in width. Like this we do on other side also, both plates must be in opposite direction. After pin up, now do stitching on it. Like this we join our bottom skirt to front and back bodice piece. After that now do press stitching taking extra fabric towards bodice piece on right side. After that we insert zip in the back bodice piece. Link is in the description. After doing this, I will proceed further. After inserting zip, now join shoulder matching right to right. After that, measure your neck. My neck circumference is 18 inch and I will cut 18 inch bukram lengthwise to make a strip for making the neck. Fold this 18 inch strip and do a bit curving at the end and cut it. Paste this band neck on this black fabric by stitching and now fold fabric under bookram like this keeping the lower straight part open. Sew it from three sides. After stitching, mark small cuts like this and take it to the right side. This is our ready band neck. And now sew it starting from one end of neck till other end. Band neck tutorial is in description. And in middle of front neck leave one inch gap. While coming to the center cut now mark one inch point and then sew other half of neck with band neck. After that, fold it and take extra fabric inside, then sew it. I have already made band neck tutorial. You can check it out in that video. This is our band neck collar and now we will make sleeves. This is our front side and this is back side. From back side at bottom, mark 3 inch widthwise and 3.5 inch lengthwise. Make a straight line and cut it. You can fold this cut either by inserting extra fabric or by just simply folding like this. 
This is our cuff cuts. Fold same from the other side also. Now place it like this and do sewing at close end for hiding the cuts. After this, now fold fabric and sew it slant wise making 0.75 inch sewing line. This is my two bookram pieces which I will use in making cuffs. This is my wrist round that is 9 inch and length is 2.5 inch. I will paste it on extra fabric just like I did on band collar pasting and I will show you how to join it with sleeves. After pasting cuff bookram piece, now take another fabric of same measurement and sew it matching right to right from three sides. Leave lower straight part from stitching. After stitching, take cuff piece to the right side and now sew it with sleeves on wrong side in a round manner. Now fold extra fabric inside and sew it alongside the cuff bookram like we did it in neck portion. Now do fitting stitching on frog and fold bottom width to your required length. After that we make puffs which I already taught you, link is in description. After making puffs, I will join sleeves and upload an image of it. If you like my video, then hit like button and if you are new here, then subscribe for more such videos. In the next video, I will teach you a new cutting or stitching in a simple way. Thank you.